Students get older, they may experience another form of education, hobbies. And as financial reporter Marianne Campbell found out, crafts can make money. Now that Mrs. Costage began as a hobby, now it is a business. Yet her prize achievement is being accepted into the Ozark Foothills Craft Guild. I really love the guild and I feel like that being a member is kind of the epitome of acceptance and excellence. The artistic pottery of Leonard Sherman gained him membership. Uh, it's part of me. Um, I uh, have been away from it uh, off and on during that period of time, but, uh, uh, but I can't stay away. It doesn't make any really any difference whether I make money at it or not. If you'd like to become a member... Uh, it gives you a chance to have a product that's made individually and that each one markets in their own individual manner and it reflects their own personality as well as their awareness of their cultural and historic background. It's a, uh, a tremendous variety of self-expression and uh, you can stay busy at it. It's completely absorbing. I'm really content and I love it. I love seeing other people's work. It's amazing to me that almost anyone can do it, even if they think it's very difficult. Arkansas is known nationwide for their fine quality crafts. And this weekend at the annual Mountain View Folk Festival, the Ozark Foothills Craft Guild will be showing and selling their wares. You have an opportunity to participate, either through membership or by purchasing some of the fine crafts to support our Arkansas artists. Marianne Campbell, Channel 4 Eyewitness News.